What's up YouTubers, welcome back to the channel, hope everyone's doing well. For today's video we're looking over the 7 modes of the major scale which have been a highly requested video on the channel, so here we go. First I want to say this is how I see the modes, okay? I relate the modes all the way to the major and minor scale. So for example if we're looking at a Mixolydian scale, I see it as a major scale but with a flat 7 degree. If we're looking at a Dorian scale, I see it as a minor, sca minor scale with a major 6th degree. Okay, that's how I see it. Some of you may see it like Mixolydian being the 5th degree of the mode, and so you're playing the scale starting on the 5th degree. For example, if you're doing G Mixolydian, you may see it as a G major scale, but starting from the D, which is the 5th degree of that scale. Again, I see it as Mixolydian being a major scale, but with a flat 7 degree. Hope this makes sense, but let's get some playing in. So, today we're looking over the modes of the major scale. It's a topic that's been highly requested, and when playing music like The Grateful Dead, modes come into play. Stuff like Dorian and Mixolydian, for example, and Ionian and Aeolian. So it's good knowledge to have in your arsenal. Now there are seven modes, and a good acronym to remember them are I don't play like my Aunt Lucy. So you have Ionian, Dorian, Phrygian, Lydian, Mixlydian, Aeolian, and Locrian. Seven modes. So now let's take a look at the modes, and we're going to all relate them to the major scale. So Ionian would be just a regular major scale, and we're going to be in the key of A today. So, Ionian, pure major scale. Everyone say it in one octave. Your classic major scale. Let's go to Dorian. Now Dorian is a minor scale, but instead of a flat six, which in the key of A would be an F, we're gonna make it a major six to F sharp. So it'll be A, B, C, D, E, F sharp, G, A. One more time. Again, Dorian is a minor scale, but with a major sixth. Next up, we have Phrygian. Phrygian, again, is a minor scale, but with a flat two. So in A minor, it would be A, B flat, C, D, E, F, G, Next up, we have Lydian. Lydian is also a major scale, but with a sharp four. So in this case, it would be A, B, C sharp, D sharp, E, F sharp, G sharp, A.
Next up, we have Mixolydian. Mixolydian is again a major scale, but instead of the major seventh, we have a minor seven. So in this case it would be A, B, C sharp, D, E, F sharp, G, A. Again. Next up we have Aeolian, which is your straight up minor scale. Last but not least, which is barely used, for me at least, is Locrian. Locrian is a minor scale, but with a flat 2 and a flat 5. So it would be A, B flat, C, D, E flat, F, G, A. and then back to major. So those are the seven modes of the major scale. So there are the seven modes of the major scale. Hope it was helpful seeing them dissected in a very slow manner. That for me when learning all this was very crucial. So here are some tips that helped me along the way learning the modes. Number one is you got to know all your notes on the fretboard. That's crucial with this kind of stuff. So you want to know where all the A's are, where B flats, where S, for example. You want to pinpoint every note on the fretboard and know it. The second is you want to know your key signatures. You want to know how many sharps or flats are in each key. No, circle of fifths. Because that, when seeing a mode or a scale is very helpful to know okay what's the major sixth or what's the minor sixth in this scale and thirdly once you progress in all that and once you get used to modes is seeing them as just different not necessarily as scales but as notes so if we take a minor for example a b c d e f G A. No, no sharps or flats. That's the exact same thing as C major, right? Which is the exact same thing as G mixed Lydian because G mixed Lydian also has no sharps or flats. G mixed Lydian is G A B C D E F G. No sharps or flats. So practice the modes, learn your fretboard, learn your key signatures, and you'll be able to take over the world. So, hope you enjoyed the video guys. If you did, leave a like, comment, subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys next time.